Okay, and welcome back. All right, now we're going to be taking on bubble crab. Yeah, bubble crab. I know. He has one of the. He has quite possibly the coolest song in the whole game and in Mega Man X5. Give me a second. I'm looking for something. Anyway, okay. Now that that's over, let's go. Let's kick some ass. Extra life, which I need because of something I just did, but you probably saw that in the last video. Alright, so let's go. Now we get to go and deal with the giant fish of death that I hate with a passion. Don't ask me why I hate him so much, and I completely miss. Yeah, he shoots a laser if you're under him, and he's just an all-around douche. Oh, I'm not supposed to be in front of him. Okay, I didn't know that. Just keep shooting the crap out of them. And the more parts you destroy... Oh yeah, also there's a secret right here, but we can't do anything with that yet. I hate him so much. I I wish he would just die. Do, do, do. We also can't get, like, any of the secrets right now because we... Oh, we can get one of them. You know what? We don't even need to kill him. I just remember that. I'm going to die, though, because I'm a complete moron. Secret. Anyway, alright, let's go get one of the items that help a lot. Alright, you gotta do this just right. You get on the wall and go, No! No, that didn't work. Not high enough. No! Yeah, see? And you have to get up onto that. And there's a heart container. Woo! Do, 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 do. Yeah. Otherwise, this boss is pretty easy. The next secret we need to get, we can't do until we beat him, which is up there. But yes. Um. Yeah. I don't know why it is that sometimes I shoot a regular buster instead of the super-powered buster, but... Or a green buster instead of a yellow buster after I charge it up. See, so watch. Bam. See, I guess it's because I'm not charging it long enough, but that's still kind of retarded. You know what? I actually kind of like that. Now that I think about it, I do kind of like this charge, but trust me, the one in Mega Man X 3 is like so retarded. Especially once you get the, uh, or no, once you get the Z Saber, that thing is really retardedly overpowered, but that's not the point. Everyone knows about the things in the game, so whatever. Alright, let's, uh... We're going to use this. Oh, by the way, we have now we are now up to date. There is no more bosses we're going to fight without weaknesses. So, yes. Time to kill. Hey, yo! This boss is actually really easy without the buster. Or with just a buster. Like, as you can see, I used to think this guy was retardedly hard, but watch. You just get him to jump, and you get him to jump, you get him to jump. So yeah, he's actually a really easy boss fight too. He's another boss I'd recommend to kill first if you really want to. Because you just need to jump over him and then he just kind of dies, or he destroys his bubble. Yeah, and also if you do it right, you can hit him twice with the wheel, but I'm obviously not doing it right. So yeah, that was uh, Bubble Crab. Bubble Crab. Now, based on where the X-Hunters are going to be next, I might go back and get that energy tank, because now I can go and get it. But, I digress. do 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 we got bubble splash. Yeah. About as useful as bubble lead. Which actually is kind of useful in a sense, but still. Okay, I'm going to have to fight that guy. Anyway, we're not going back to get bubble crab's thing yet because I want to destroy these X hunters because that's how I roll. 
I'm half tempted to go through this game a second time so I can show you what happens if I don't get the X, or if I don't fight the X hunters. But I've never done that fight before, so that should give me a reason why I should. Okay, now when we start this level off, we go up. Just jump on his that part right there, and uh, bam, E tank. He comes back. Don't worry. Doesn't he? There he is. Yeah. So you just go right here, and then, oh, ooh, nope. You get him to go to this wall right here and go, blap. Anyway, for those of you who don't know about the E-Tanks, the way you gain them is, oh, I already explained that, never mind. Ow. Now go, just go really fast, because there's an, there's a, the heart tank is in this part, and you have to destroy one of those retarded wall enemy things right here. Before the, it, the fire's not an instant kill, but it hurts. It's not a fun thing to get caught by. Either hey right. Anyway, all right, let's go. I just remembered I have to go up here. Oh, you're kidding me, right? Thank God. Okay, now we're going to go and fight surges. I have a full tank. Whew, I hate this boss. Let's go fight surges. Surges battle. This is going to be hell. I am surges, and I cannot allow you to stop the unification. It is for the good of all. I don't know why he sounds like Dave Mustaine, but he does. Anyway... I am great at this boss fight, if you couldn't tell. Yeah, you can't hurt him when that purple shield is around him. I don't know how well you can see that purple shield, but... When you're playing, you'll notice it. Yeah, you can even step on it, too, but... He also has a weakness, I just don't know what it is. I think all the bosses do. I just don't know what any of them are, because I always fight them with this. Thank God I didn't fight a, uh, file in first. That'd, that would have been hell. Okay, I'm going to use an E-Tank. Sub-Tank. Mm -hmm. To use to uh, Mega Man 2 and whatnot. Hate this boss fight. I really don't... Even if I... I think I know what his weakness is, but... I don't think I have it, so... <laughs> That's also another factor. Every time I fight the bosses, I, like, never have their weakness. I believe I have violins, though. So that's gonna make life easy. He's running into me. Yeah, you can step on that platform. You've merely delayed the inevitable. We will meet again. Again, I still don't know why he sounds like Dave Mustaine, but... Hey. I got zero part number two, or one, or three. I don't know which one that was, but... Oh, yeah, it was three. And we're only missing one zero part. I still don't know how to get that extra life. If I knew, I would get it, but... I'm not that intelligent. Flying squirrels with fire tails. And gas is coming out of the wall, so... Fuck you. That one always hits me, and I always let it hit me, too. I don't know why. Squirrels! I hate squirrels! Squirrels! You suck! Anyway. Ow. I hate flying squirrels in this game, dude. Just... <laughs> I like the song in this stage, though. It's not my favorite one, but it's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool guy who doesn't afraid of anything. But anyway. I digress. Okay. Basically, he goes up and then he comes back down. And he has a bunch of attacks, but this is the only one you really need to look out for. There's not really that much to say about this boss fight whenever you're using bubble. Just jump every time you get hit, every time you attack. Pretty soon here, he's supposed to be shooting blue fire. Like, at a certain point, he gets angry and he throws blue fire, which does more damage. But, as you can see, it doesn't really matter. 
Yeah. So there's that. Oh, I did, I forgot. We shoot. We now shoot fire in an upwards motion. That's what the attack is. I don't remember what it's called. And where is it? If it's the moth. Son of a Jesus. All right. Let me uh split this into another video. I'll be right back.